The uh, rain came down in buckets earlier today and communities tonight still underwater in some spots. Tim Pamplin spent the day in Chesterfield Township documenting the flood and that's where neighbors have a message for city leaders. The rain started pouring over Chesterfield Township just after the lunch hour. I've never seen the rain so heavy before. Flooding out the subdivision near I-94 and 21 Mile Road, stranding several motorists. Watching the rain pour and pour and pour and pour, and this is filling and filling and filling. I couldn't get out. Even the wildlife seemed a little perplexed by all this water. Drivers, nonetheless, continue to drive through the flooded streets in this subdivision, pushing thousands of gallons of water throughout the neighborhood. The wake from this disaster is coming close enough into my garage. My basement is flooding, my backyard is flooding. The minute I saw my backyard flooding behind the shed, I had to run and empty my shed out, all my lawn equipment, otherwise I would have lost it all. My generators, everything, I would have lost everything. Some residents told me this exact same thing happened just a couple of weeks ago. And they want answers and they're not getting any. And to have them tell me that, oh, their pumps are working, well, obviously their pumps aren't working. I ran into this happy fellow, name's Brandon. Uh, DoorDash right now, but I just graduated. I'm gonna be a history teacher and it can't happen any sooner, let me tell you. You see Brandon's car, well, he's not in it. It's down the street. And when he pulled into this subdivision, he had a decision to make. I've never, you know, never dealt with a situation like this, so I thought I could crank through, made it all the way to the end and the car stalled out. He's going the extra mile. Still got a job to do. <laughs> You have a blessed one, sir. You too, cheers. <laughs> a little slice of life here in the Brycewood subdivision, 21 mile and 94. Everybody here holding their breath with more storms in the forecast. They hope the township or the county can do something about the repeated flooding here in the Brycewood subdivision. In Chesterfield Township, Tim Pamplin, Local 4.